yo, baby, right here. I got that official. Come and get it all day. Hey, yo, 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 don't spend your money with that kid. That's that garbage right there. Come get this truth right here. Hey, yo, man. I'm trying to get this money. What's nah, the deal, baby? Don't worry about that money. I want to talk to you about Jesus. Hey, yo, man. What you know about Jesus? I'm trying to get this money, baby. I'm trying to pay that these bills. It's the survival of the fittest out here, baby. I'm trying to eat. What about Jesus? Let me speak to you about Jesus. Hey, yo, man. It's thug life. What you know about on the streets, kid? Thug life? Yo, man, I'm trying to get this paper. Let me talk to you, baby. Listen. Thug life, listen to me, man. You moving too fast. You need to slow down and try to choose a new path. I look at your life and see you headed straight for the can. Cause you've been tricked to think big guns make you a man. You think anything backed up or make you a grand. You so money hungry, quick to put your faith in the scam. Everything's all good until you placed in the jam. You ain't satisfied until you got a case on your hands. Thug life, the game ain't all that they said it to be. I wish I listened when Jesus said this to me for real. It would have saved me a lot of lost time. You got a hunger. For the game, well, thank God I lost mine. I know you got pain in you, and the pain runs deep. Everything you've been influenced by came from the streets. Now you love to get high and gotta thank for the heat. All you talk about is how you wanna bang with me. behind bars it would devastate me to see you right behind the charge i remember the streets and how they caught me off guard the little things they whispered when i was down to my last like everything i ever needed could be bought selling slabs the only thing i found is that the drugs was cursed brothers that came to the game left the game in the hearse if they didn't leave dead then they left in the raid went to trial and got sentenced to time in the cage and if you make the papers you'll get less than the pay saying society's better now that you rest in the grave i can see clearly now that i'm blessed and i'm saved and it was god that cleaned up every mess that I made. He went every place with me, whether I left or I stayed. Rescued me from danger, gave me rest when I prayed. Angels camped around me, cause it was death where I played. Satan was on me like vultures on a nest full of eggs. Never left me unprotected. I could have died. Sometimes I found myself in front of weapons they shot, but the guns either missed or they jammed. I stayed alive. I got the chance to live for the lamb. I'm covered by blood that came from the wrist of the lamb. That's why when Satan tried to grab me, I would slip through his hands. I was destined to make it. Once God called me his, picture me leaving his side. After all he did, regardless, you gotta love him. After all, he is the one that died for us. After all we did, I'm sorry, thug life, but I gotta be honest. Accept him right now, cause tomorrow ain't promised. What's going on, y'all? 
My name is Minister Trevor Pope, and you just finished listening to one of my songs called Thug Life off of my album entitled The Atonement. And I just wanted to encourage you, if you're somebody out there, you're struggling with the thug life, you're struggling in, with ripping and running the streets, or you might even have a family member or a friend that's running the streets, I just want to encourage you and let you know that Jesus loves you and that God cares for you and that he can change your situation around, that he can change your life. And how do I know? Because he did it for me. Because I ran the streets and was in and out of jail and lost my mind in the streets. I went through so many different things, lost friends and family members, but Glory be to God, I'm still here because of his grace and mercy. And I believe that he wants to do the same for you on today. He wants to bring you in and use you so that you can tell your testimony of what you've been through and that you can make it. Amen. The Bible says in Romans 10 and 9 that if you confess the Lord Jesus with your mouth and believe in your heart that God has raised him from the dead, you shall be saved. And that's what I'm inviting you to do today is to get saved, to give Jesus your life, to make him your Lord and Savior. Because how many know tomorrow is just not promised to any of us? Amen. And if you can't honestly say that if you died on tonight, that you would make it into heaven. If you can't honestly say that if you died tonight, you don't know where you would go, then you need to make Jesus your Lord and Savior. If you feel God is tugging at your heart, I want you to repeat this prayer after me. Say, Father God, I come to you as humbly as I know how. For you said in your word that if I confess the Lord Jesus with my mouth and believe in my heart that you raised him from the dead, that I shall be saved. And Father, I believe that on today. And I want to make Jesus my Lord and Savior. Father, I thank you that by faith I am forgiven. That by faith I am saved. And that on today my name has been written in the Lamb's book of life. I give you all the glory, all the honor, and all the praise. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. If you prayed that prayer with me, know that you have made the greatest, the greatest decision today of your life by making Jesus your Lord and Savior. And I just want you to know that we love you here at Righteous Work. I love you. And I just want you to know that if you need to call up, if you want to call us up and you got a prayer request, you can call us up at 203-522-7409. That's 203-522-7409. And leave your prayer request on the answering machine and we will definitely keep you lifted up in prayer. And even if you just want to call and let us know that you made Jesus your Lord and Savior on today. We would truly appreciate it. We thank you. Continue to keep us up in prayer. Continue to keep me up in prayer. That God will continually give me boldness to go forth telling my testimony and telling of his goodness so that somebody might be saved. I thank you. I love you. In Jesus' name. Bye-bye.